Mau ini? Ya, coba. Hello guys. Hello you too. Yeah, kembali lagi kita di video kali ini. So this time we really want to talk about parenting, especially solid food. Solid food, makanan halus kalau kita bilang orang Indonesia. Karena so, itu uh, hanya sesuatu yang kita buat sekarang. Yeah. <laughs> dari makan, dari makan, dari makan. Makan, tidur, makan, tidur, makan, tidur. <laughs> Terutama khususnya dengan sirup ya. side Ruth oh it's this side so Dr. Saya Dr. Kita Dr. Mm -hmm. Kita Dr. Ruth Dr. Nya Ruth yeah Dr. Nya Ruth bilang yang kita bisa makan beri beri makan, makan. Um, apa saja apa saja okay basically if you can kalau kita bisa um, squish oh the uh, diancurin. Diancurin. Uh, yeah. uh, makanan between these yeah. two fingers. Yeah. Then she should be able to mush it between her yeah. jaws. Yeah. Yeah. Even though she doesn't have teeth. So pretty much in Indonesia also the same. Yeah. Like you want to give like a small, Mush. soft, soft mushy uh, food that the baby can eat. But the difference is in Indonesia, kita. Uh, Buat makanan itu fresh. We make it fresh every day. At least that is from what I've seen. Gimana? My cousins. Gimana punya? My cousins. Uh, what to? Yeah. How do you have time to do jadi, that? Jadi kalau kita di Indonesia kan kebanyakan. Every meal, uh, setiap makanan. Not always every meal, but at least every day. Wow. They make fresh. When? Then kebanyakan with rice, with porridge, mm -hmm. with porridge rat nasi, and then they mix it with some uh, meat broth and mm -hmm. some ground meat, mm -hmm. ground meat. Yeah. Okay, so here in America, they they sell the type of baby food in a form in a form of jars, right? Yes. In a form of jars. In Indonesia, setahu saya kita jualnya seperti uh, makanan baik kayak. Uh, makanan baik in the form of like oatmeal, mm -hmm. the baby oatmeal. So you put water and then you mix it. So at the beginning of introducing the solid food to you, I think we just had some food on hand. So then I was like, all right, let's just puree it and see puree. what happens. Puree means like a blend, blend. And them. Yeah. it just kind of became like what we always did. And then I saw on like vlogs, like mommy vlogs, parenting vlogs, that people were freezing purees in ice cube trays and then they were sticking them in the freezer and then in freezer bags and then they would just have like a month's worth of one type of food so you don't have to make it every day yeah um and then it allows you to have variety every day um so it was like a lot of work right in the beginning but so we're feeding our baby frozen food but it's like a fresh frozen food that we we made it <laughs> ourselves yeah <laughs> and we try to feed her like a fruit Vegetables, yeah. satu sayuran, satu buah, satu grain, yeah. satu protein, satu, satu protein. Karbohidrat. Karbohidrat. Yeah. Good job. <laughs> Terima kasih. 
Ruth, ma, ma canción? Ma canción? Siang ini kita mau kasih makan lagi uh... Cek kulkas ya? Yeah. Freezer. Freezer Apa itu? Ini... Mungkin cantaloupe lewa? Blewa? Blewa oh. atau um, squash Ini apa? Quinoa uh, Do you still have beef? Masih ada beef? Ya, yeah, di, di dalam ya yeah. You want beef? Pure yes. beefy? Sapi? Masapi? Daging sapi. Daging sapi. <laughs> Can you find it? Ah, uh, yeah. Belum. Belum, belum, belum. Then <laughs> I know it. Oh, John and I might try to eat like this from now on. <laughs> we'll just make giant you, ice cubes you. for ourselves. It'll be like one for you. Mama size, papa size, <laughs> baby size. Jadi, uh, dia suka ya. Ah, uh, tapi kita beri makan um, telur fresh. Telur, ya. Yeah. Ya. Yeah. Telur fresh. Oh, telur ya. Telur kita kita masak kita makan telur tofu atau tahu. Itu yeah. kita beli yang fresh dan kita uh, hancurin. Hancurin kita kayak uh, rebus dan hancurin. Kacang. Kacang, kacang ya. Kacang, kacang kacang hitam kita kita yeah. beli yang fresh. In Indonesia, we, we, we believe to eat like fresh food every day, but the tricky part here, I mean, I think this is very practical if you take care of your baby yourself, you and your spouse. Uh, in, we don't have the luxury of having like a helpers or having uh, somebody to help the Yeah. Yeah, there's no one like here to help. Mama, or Mama Martua, or misalnya Tante, or Saudara, or Ongi, who can help. So, I barely have time to microwave. I know. Then this in me, then and here, microwave is one of common household items. Yeah, every yeah. Thing, pretty much. Setiap rumah, setiap rumah punya microwave. Ini beda dengan di Indonesia. Di microwave kita masukin yang udah uh, apa namanya ice blocks. Ini itu kita masukin. So it takes about how many seconds? I do like a minute, about a minute. Yeah, sekitar satu minit. Satu minit yeah. untuk dicairkan dan udah langsung hangat, langsung tinggal kita ma kasih makan. Kalau di yeah. Indonesia, ini in Indonesia, like not every house has yeah, the luxury so of yeah the microwave. So having frozen food would be take all day to thaw. Yeah, you have to thaw it. Yeah, you have to Yeah, right. So far, <laughs> Ruth, uh, how how do you think Ruth? Uh, she with the food. So. I think it's easy. No, it's not 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 easy. No, it's here, I wonder, I ask a question. Apakah orang beri makan makanan allergy? Oh, so hmm. allergy, according to me, uh, at least from what I know, I, I don't speak for the whole country, but at least from what I've seen with my cousins, with my. <laughs> So kalau di sini teman-teman orang-orang itu sangat hati-hati dalam memberikan makanan yang uh, yang alergi yang berpotensi uh, menimbulkan reaksi alergi terutama seperti di sini kan banyak orang alergi kacang alergi susu alergi macam-macam. Nah kalau yang alergi telur ada alergi protein macam-macam. Nah di Indo di sini itu jadi uh, dokter menyarankan untuk masing-masing uh, dokter beda-beda tapi mereka menyarankan untuk memberi makan makanan-makanan uh, yang alergi itu sedini mungkin. Ya, yeah. so here banyak anak-anak punya uh, allergi. 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 Yeah. Uh, tapi tidak tahu karena uh, alasan. Uh -huh. Ya. Yeah, um, tapi lebih dan lebih, more and more anak-anak berkembang punya alergi. Punya alergi. Ya. Punya alergi. Nah kalau di Indonesia alergi itu ada sebenarnya, uh, ada sebenarnya. Cuman uh, kayaknya 
tidak banyak kasus mungkin saya yang kurang tahu ya yeah, maybe I just didn't know anyone no I Or... I know people but it's not something that is very common in Indonesia and it's not yeah. increasing their like from my, here from my personal experience based yeah. on what I've seen with my cousins mm -hmm. and my nieces and nephews yeah yeah so teman-teman ini kalau uh, for you guys who knows like who, many kids, many kids. What are the recommendations from uh, from the pediatricians uh, right now in Indonesia for babies? Yeah. Babies. Okay, guys. Makasih untuk menonton videonya ya. Kalau suka video ini, klik button di bawah. Klik tombol like di bawah. Dan menulis komentar. Ya, tulis komentar di bawah. Dan uh, jangan lupa juga follow Instagram kita ya. Yeah. Nah, boleh, boleh. Yes, yes, yes. Alright guys, sampai jumpa di video selanjutnya. Dadah. 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 Selamat datang kembali di my Brule Brule family. Brule Brule. <laughs> my Brule Brule. You said Brule Brule. Um. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, can you say Mama? Yeah, Mama. Mama. Say Mama. Mama. Papa, Papa mana? <laughs> so, we... Sorry for that. Uh... Di sini ada they have they so. Hey, <laughs> di sini <laughs> lihat itu orang-orang dah. Hi guys, dah hi guys. Jadi so here they so they they say. <laughs> okay. Jadi di sini ada mereka yang jual di, di supermarket yang seperti itu, tapi ada juga yang di dalam uh, botol-botol kecil ya. <laughs> <I'm> so sorry. <laughs>